So they're saying a significant policing operation to manage the multiple protests uh, in Dublin. As you say, over two and a half thousand officers uh, will be on duty around the country, but around, as you say, 300 in the city centre. So that includes uh, three public order units with a capacity for about, I think, 25, up to 25 each. And then that will also include uniformed officers and then plain clothes uh, officers. And then there'll be extra checkpoints uh, around Dublin uh, to uh, monitor people trying to get into the city centre and there'll also uh, be uh, checkpoints uh, further down as well and it checks on, on train stations for example, people who will be travelling or plan to travel uh, to Dublin for specifically for these protests and I suppose people are warned that uh, travelling to a protest it's not an essential reason to leave your home, it's not a, a reasonable excuse to leave your home. So the idea will be that we're the Guardian are trying to stop people from getting into the city centre at all, so they'll be yeah. cutting them off at various routes and various access points. Yes, so the they've city. been monitoring the groups on social media, they've been infiltrating uh, those uh, groups, and so really tactically what they'll be trying to do is stop, uh, they know who, who are, who, who's organising these protests, so they, they know where they live and they'll be trying to nab them, I suppose, on their routes in, in order to stop a number of people from, from, from travelling in and asking them well, why they're travelling tomorrow and, and if they refuse refuse to comply, refuse to turn back, then they will be fined. And then organisers of these events, also they face a file going to the DPP if they don't comply.